Hi, I'm Tim from Jim's Handyman, and I'm here at the National Office today because the guys got a few problems with one of their doors and they've asked me to drop by and fix it for them. First off, we've got some hinge problems. Some of the screws are loose and they can't actually get one out, and we've got a door that won't actually lock properly. So I'm going to show you today how to fix that. So as you can see, that screw just keeps on turning and turning and turning. So what we have to do, best way, is to plug it. First off, we take the screw out. Okay, so now that we've got the screw out, I'm going to show you one of the tricks that my grandfather actually taught me. What we do is grab some matchsticks, just your normal everyday matchsticks. We put some glue on the end of it and we plug it in the hole. Now popping it in the hole, the glue will actually form and hold it in place and the matchsticks will actually fill the void. Once that's in there, it's just a matter of breaking them off. Now the best thing to do is let that glue dry off for a bit. Go and have a cup of tea, and then come back and you'll be right to go. Okay, so now that you've let that glue dry, time to put the screw back in and it'll tighten up nice and snug. There you have it, nice and tight, ready to go. That door's not gonna fall off anytime soon. Okay, so now we're on to the second problem. The bottom screw in this door hinge can't come out. If you have a closer look at it, you'll actually see that the head's been stripped. I'm gonna show you a nifty little trick that sometimes works to get these screws out. Let me show you. Okay, so all we have to do is place a rubber band over the top of the screw head, put the drill in, push hard, and watch it undo. There we go, we've got our pesky little screw out. Now we can put a new one in and the door will be fine. Okay, there you have it. Problem number two solved. Now we'll move on to the third problem, the door not shutting properly. Okay, so now we're on to our third problem with this door. What we're actually gonna do is make it so that it closes, because you see, it actually just won't close properly. So what's actually happening here is when the door latch comes in, it's actually stopping short of the striker plate. So what we do is take the striker plate off, file out a little bit of the front plate there, and then pop it back on and see how that operates. Okay, so now that we've filed out our plate, we can put it back on and we'll test our door and see how we go. Look at that, perfect. 